This is gonna be, this is gonna be good.
Live from Phoenix, Arizona, it's Steve Summers. Hey, 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 we made it to Friday. I can't believe it. Oh, my goodness. Shall we get this thing started up today or what? I don't know about you, but I think we're going to have fun today on today's show. Let's go back, shall we? Saturday morning cartoons right here. Show you. Uh, honey, honey. Sugar, you are my candy girl, and you got me wanting. I just can't believe the loveliness of loving you. I just can't believe it's true. I just can't believe the wonder of this feeling too. I just can't believe it's true. Oh, now, sugar. Sponsor Link Senior. Go to linksenior.com. Check out the wonderful communities. Over 400 plus communities we broadcast to and play each and every week. And we're so glad that you took your time out to be with us today in our great American Songbook Friday show today. And a few songs we haven't done in a while, including this one right here from the Crew Cuts. You might remember this one. A little shaboom, shall we now? As we go back. If I could take you up to paradise up above If you would only tell me I'm the one that you would love Life could be a dream, sweetheart Hello, hello again If me again, I'm moving in The life could be a dream If only all my precious plans would come true If you would let me spend my whole life loving you Life could be a dream, sweetheart Now every time I look at you, you, something is on my mind da, 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 If you do what I want you to do Baby, we'd be so fine oh, Life could be a dream If we could take you up to paradise up above If you would only tell the only one that you love Life could be a dream, sweetheart Shaboom, shaboom, la 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 la. Shaboom, shaboom, ya la 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 la. Shaboom. What's that? Shaboom, shaboom, la 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 la. Shaboom, shaboom, la 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 la. Shaboom, shaboom, ya la 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 la. Shaboom. Every time I look at you. Something is on my mind If you do what I want you to Baby, we'd be so fine oh, Life could be a dream If I could take you up to paradise up above 
If you would tell me that I'm the only one that you love Life could be a dream, sweetheart Hello, hello, hello again. again So boom, boom and boom and boom and again Boom, boom La, 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 Remember that song from a long, long time ago? Maybe not. <laughs> Life could be a All the great songs of the past. Life could be a dream. Life could be a dream. If only all my fantasy dreams come true. If you would let me spend my whole life loving you. Life could be a dream, sweetheart. Back then, it was doo ops on the corner. Crew cuts. Bobby socks. And a pack of cigs right there on the show. <laughs> I love that song, going back a little ways. Welcome to the show today. We've got a joke coming up from my friend Sandra's got one coming up here in just a little bit. This one is kind of corny today, so get ready. <laughs> Let's go back to a song made famous by one of my favorite uh, singers, Mr. Engelbert Humperdinck made this song famous. A song about bicycles. We love bicycle songs. On our special Friday show, we call it our free-for-all right here. that song. Engelbert Humperdinck made that song a huge hit back in the day. A song all about bicycles. Yes, you guessed right. Bicycles. Here <laughs> I show today. Lots of sunshine today here in the valley. Playing America's songbook right here. Every night I hope and pray Dream lover come my way Girl I can hold in my I want a girl to call my home. I want a dream lover so I don't have to dream alone. Dream lover, where are you with the love or oh, so true? Girl, to 
going back a few ways in our show today and by the way we need to recognize a great birthday. we got a couple of birthdays today we've got a uh, birthday Remember, how many of you guys can tell me who this gentleman is right here who can tell me who this is who is this guy right here American jazz vocalist conductor known for his 1988 hit this song when it came out people were going nuts every I think every radio station and every format was playing this song <laughs> It's one of those feel-good songs, but all the way to number one naturally here in America, number two in the UK. The track won Song of the Year, Record of the Year in the 1989 Grammy Awards. Ladies and gentlemen, happy birthday to the great Bobby McFerrin today. Born on this date in 1950, Bobby McFerrin. You guys remember the song, right? I know you do. A lot of you watching the show know this. You're, and, you, and I know you can sing it with me too. Shall we? Shall we do it together? Why not? Bobby McFerrin, happy birthday. <laughs> Let's go back, I know. I think after a while when we did this song, it was like, <laughs> I don't think we've ever done this song before, now that we think about it now. What's that? I think let's bring on some rainbows. How about that? Don't worry, be happy, right? Our Friday get together. Here's a little song I wrote. It might want to sing it note for note. Don't worry. What? Be happy. Did I hear you? In every life, we have some trouble. But when you worry, you make it double. Don't worry. Everybody, help me out now. Be happy. Don't worry. Be happy now. Don't worry. Be happy. Don't worry. Be happy now. Be happy. You're alive. Ain't got no place to lay your head. Somebody came and took your bed. Well, don't worry. Be happy. The landlord say your rent is late. He may have to litigate. Don't worry. Be happy. Look at me, I'm happy right now. Everybody now, don't worry. Be happy. Here, I'll give you my phone number. You can call me in when you're not worried and you may make me happy, baby. Don't worry. Be happy. I got no cash, got no style Got no gal to make you smile Don't worry Be happy 
Cause when you worry, your face will frown And that will bring everybody down Don't worry, what do you do? Be happy Don't worry, be happy now Don't worry Be happy I know gas prices are high right now, but you're alive, right? Don't worry. You got a runny nose. Here, have a Kleenex. <laughs> now there's a song. This is I wrote. I hope you learned it note for note. Like good little children, right? Be happy. Listen to what I say. In your life, expect some trouble. When you worry, you make it double. Don't worry. Hey, you're alive. Be happy. Be happy now. Don't worry. Be happy. I think we're in good hands, don't you think? I think we're gonna be okay. Don't worry. You're not alone. Be happy. Don't worry, be happy. Oh, get that front off your face. Put a smile on your face. Or as they say, take that frown and turn it upside down. Don't worry, be happy. I love it. Oh, we're having too much fun today already. <laughs> oh, happy birthday to Bobby McFerrin today, born on this date in 1950 day. 1950 day. 1950. Good night. Maybe I need to start drinking before I do these shows. I can't even talk now. <laughs> anyway, welcome to the show. We made it to Friday. We're about nine minutes away from our trivia today. And believe it or not, it is joke time. Come on now. Come is this on. another of your morbid jokes? Oh, yes. Thank you so much to Cindy who sent in this corny joke. <laughs> yeah, we have corny jokes here. What kind of sandwiches can make... What kind of sandwiches... Can you make at the beach? Cindy asks. What kind of sandwiches can you make at the beach? She says, peanut butter and jellyfish sandwiches. <laughs> oh, that is just gross. <laughs> I can't even, you know, when you get older, it gets kind of disgusting when you think about stuff like that. <laughs> your, your stomach kind of turns just a little bit. Oh, my goodness. I'm telling you right now. All right. Nickels and dimes, memories and wine. He's gone his mind once again. The same old stew, the same old fool. Played by the rules but didn't win. And there's an old lump in his heart, but he can't lose. He tried forgetting. But he knows just what to do He's got a fool-hearted memory If won't let him see That she walks out the door He's got a fool-hearted memory If won't let him be Here every night so it can fool him more Was his girl his only word? That string of pearls that slipped away a thousand times, a thousand times. He doesn't mind what they say. He fills the jukebox and he plays the same old song. He fills his glass. And he turns her memory on But it's a fool-hearted memory If won't let him see 
Then she walked out the door He's got a fool heart and memory He sits patiently Here every night So it can fool him more He's got a fool heart and memory If only let him see Then she walked out the door He's got a fool He sits patiently here every night so it can fool him more. We just set that out to Dan who watches the show out east. Dan, thank you so much for all the great folks who actually watch the show. And we appreciate that. But you know, as they say on this particular show, oh uh, yeah, George Strait, you know, you can't just sing one country song, you gotta sing two. We always say that here on the show. And one of my all time favorites is one. Charlie. Whenever I chance to meet some old friends on the street, they wonder how does a man get to be this way. I've always got a smile and face, any time or any place. And every time I ask me why, just smile and say. But you've got to kiss an angel good morning And let her know you think about her when you're gone Kiss an angel good morning And love her like the devil when you get back home People may try to guess The secret of my happiness some of them never learn is just a simple thing Now the secret I'm speaking of Is a woman and a man in love And the answer is in the song that I always sing But you've got to kiss an angel good morning And let her know you think about her when you're gone Kiss an angel good morning And love her like the devil when you get back home Kiss an angel good morning And let her know you'll think about her when you're gone Kiss an angel good morning And love her like the devil when you get back home Time movie here today. Let's get this thing started. What do you say? Shall we do it now? One, two, three, yeah! One, two, three. Woo! Feeling good now. Come on. You gotta know how to pony. Like Bonnie Monroe. The mashed potato. Do the alligator. Put your hands on your slip, let your backbone slip, do the what to say, like my little Lucy. Come on now, we made it to Friday, how about you? Come on. Na 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 na, na 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 Come on y'all, help me out now, here we go. Na 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 na, na 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 Woo, come on. Oh. All right, y'all feeling pretty good for a Friday. Let me hear you out there. All the Link Senior folks watching the show today, we appreciate you. Come on. You ready? Are you already doing it already? Nah. <laughs> it's like catching up right now, isn't it? Come here, here we go now. One more time. Na 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 Playing with the habit with long tall Sally. Twisted with Lucy. Find the white to say, roll over on your back. Oh, I like. 
bring it back there to the church. Now watch me work you But today, Friday show. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. All right. What about you? They're still dancing away. Mac potato. The purpose of a Of love, love, la 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 la. It started long ago in the Garden of Eden when Adam said to Eve, "Baby, you're for me." So come on, baby, let's start today. Come on, baby, let's play the game of love, love, la 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 la. Come on, baby, 'cause the time is right. Love your daddy, walk all your might. Put your arms in and hold me tight. Play the game. The purpose of a man is to love a woman, and the purpose of a woman is to love a man. Now come on, baby, let's start to play. Come on, baby, let's play a game of love. Love, la 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 la. Come on, come right now. That's baby. Come on, baby. Of a man is to love a woman, and the purpose of a woman is to love her man. So come on, baby, let's start today. Come on, baby, let's play game of love, love, la 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 la, game of love, baby. There we go. Try dancing down the stairway there. <laughs> We're having way too much fun here on this Friday show today, guys. Thank you so much for coming out, hanging out with me today. We always do this each and every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And you know what the time is? Let's do it. Come on. All right. Thank you so much for the wonderful folks over at Link Senior, actually Link Senior over at the uh, Trivia Channel for making it happen today. We sure appreciate that. Uh, we ask the questions. And uh, you give us the answers. It's real easy. One channel. There we go. Something happened. There we go. I'm having a little bit of audio issue right now. Something. There we go. It fixed it. So I don't know what happened. You know, things happen live on the show. I have no idea what happens. <laughs> anyway, it's trivia time. For those of you who just joined us, it's real easy. We ask the questions. We give you three multiple choice answers. Thank you to the folks at Trivia Channel for making it happen. And last time, we did this on Wednesday. Uh... Most of you got most of the, the answers right. So I applaud you. Nice job, everybody. How do you keep track of it? You just, at the end, we'll ask and find out how many got them right, how many got half of them right, and good luck to you. What is the coliacs allergic to? What are coliacs allergic to? If you're a coliac, you probably already know the answer to this one. Is it chocolate? Is it nuts? Or is it gluten? Chocolate, nuts, or gluten? And why does everything, why does everything have to have a catch to it? Seems like, as my dad used to say, my late dad, I miss him so much, as dad used to say, if it tastes good, spit it out. <laughs> Because chances are it's probably not good for you. So what are coliacs? What are they allergic to? Is it chocolate, nuts, or gluten? Let's find out, see if you got it right. First question out of the bin. If you said, Boop. gluten, you had it right. People with coliac disease, the immune system reacts abnormally to gluten. It affects people of all ages, both male and female. It's not just of one or the other. All right, what year was Steve Jobs born? What year was Steve Jobs born? Was it 1955? Was it 1960? Or was it 1965? The year Steve Jobs was born. Keep that in mind, Steve Jobs. 
Let's see here. I mean, there we go. Technical issue. 55, 60, or 65? See if you got it right. A, B, or C. Good luck on this. All right. By the way, the winner gets a brand new car. Just kidding. Correct answer is 1955, the year Steve Jobs was born. Of course, co-founder of Apple, was born 24th of February, just celebrated his birthday last month, 1955, San Francisco, California. All right, which organ is sometimes referred to as the gullet? I love this question. What is the organ that is often referred to as the gullet? Is it the eyelids, is it the esophagus, or is it the mouth? The gullet. For those of you who are my age, those of you my age will know the answer to this one. A gullet. What is it? I'm pointing at it right now. The esophagus. <laughs> esophagus, commonly referred to as the gullet. It's an organ through which food passes from the pharynx to the stomach. All right. Arachnology includes the study of what? Arachnology. It's the study of what? Is it the sentence structure? Colors or colours? Or is it spiders? I hate spiders. Have I told you how much I hate spiders? Anyway, arachnology includes a study of, did you hear they're actually going to be dropping a bunch of spiders on the East Coast? I don't even, I don't even want to read the news story because I know, I know what's going to happen. I, am, it's a good thing I don't live on the East Coast. My wife and I were talking. If I was living on the East Coast and they were going to drop a bunch of spiders down for whatever reason they're doing it, no spider is a nice spider in my opinion. I would be moving if I lived on the East Coast. No thanks. Don't want them. Thank you. Sentence structure. Colors or spiders? Arachnology includes the study of what? What is it? A, B, or C? See if you get it right. Correct answer is those naughty, naughty spiders. Arachnology, the scientific study of arachnids, includes spiders and related animals such as scorpions. We have them here in... Uh, 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 let's move on. All right. Which Disney movie features the song once upon a dream now a lot of you have grandkids probably watched this movie once upon a dream which was it from sleeping beauty aladdin or the little mermaid oh we watch a lot of these shows around here disney movie featuring the song once upon a dream it was it sleeping beauty aladdin or the little mermaid i could sing the jungle book song all day today <laughs> bare necessities answer is Sleeping Beauty. Sleeping Beauty it is. Once Upon a Dream, written for the animated musical film. Sleeping Beauty based on Tchaikovsky's ballet. All right, time for a couple of more? Okay. Which country hosted the 2004 Olympic Games? Oh, Steve, this is easy. Yeah, right. Was it Greece, Australia, or China? Who do you think it was? Which country hosted the 2004 Olympic Games? Greece, Australia, or China? See if you get it right. Correct answer is, ready? Greece. It was Greece. There you go. 2004 Summer Olympic Games held in Athens, Greece. Also denoted the return of Olympics, the city of its origin. We got one time for one more. Which of the following words is spelt correctly? Oh, this is a good one. I love these. Woo! All right, here we go. I can't wait to get it wrong. Which of the following words is spelt correctly? Is it pneumonia, pneumonia, or pneumonia? <laughs> You can even say I'm wrong. What do you think it is? Pneumonia, pneumonia, or neoma? Now, you notice the difference between the two right here. If you look closely, the E and the U. So there you go. All right. We have a lot of uh, retired teachers who watch this show who are going to know the answer to this one. Hey, I didn't do too bad in English. I actually made a B. All right. Correct answer is... Uh-huh. B. Did you get it? New, N-E-U, M-O-N-I-A, according to Google, pneumonia, 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 alongside beautiful, had the most. There you go. That's it. See how fast and quickly he's playing the trivia. All right. Moving everything out of the way, moving all the furniture back out of the way off the screen here. All right, how many got most of them right? Raise your hand. Not bad. Not bad. How many got half of them right at least? Good, good, good. How many got two or three right? That's okay. Nice. All right. Well, listen, we always have so much fun. We'll do it again on Monday. And thank you so much for the wonderful folks over at Trivia Channel for making it happen, too, as well. We sure appreciate them and appreciate all the great folks who actually make this show happen, including me, myself, and I, and my wife, who allows me to come in here and do this show each and every day. I'm kidding. Anyway, she does. But anyway, so let's move on. America's Songbook. I had a request from Becky, 
who is down south. She, she watches the show all the time. She says, do you ever do any Everly Brothers? We love Everly Brothers around here. So let's go back, show. Come on. Yeah. What are we gonna tell our friends when they say, Ooh la la, wake up a little Susie, wake up a little Susie. Well, I told your mama that we'd be in by ten. Well, Susie, baby, looks like we goofed again. Wake up a little Susie, wake up a little Susie. We gotta go home. so hot it didn't have much of a plot we fell asleep our gooses cooked our reputation is shot wake up a little Susie wake up a little Susie well what are we gonna tell your mama what are we gonna tell your pop what are we gonna tell our friends when they say ooh la la wake up a little Susie wake up a little Susie go for our listeners and our fans down south who watch this show and of course we had another request the other day somebody says Steve what about that one song well I've never been to Spain but I kind of like the music I think I'm gonna go to the bakery and sing see the ladies are insane there and they sure know how to use it. I'll take some donuts, please. They don't refuse it. Never gonna lose it. I can't refuse it. Mm -mm. Well, I never been to England. But I kind of like the Beatles. Well, I headed for Las Vegas. Only made it out of needles Well, can you feel it? Must be real it It feels so good It feels so good Well, I never been to heaven But I've been to Oklahoma I was raised there Well, they tell say we go to Oklahoma City for a tour the city I was born in right here this is on their trolley by the way downtown Oklahoma City
Hoyt Axton wrote that song many, many years ago. And yes, Hoyt Axton, born in Oklahoma. I always like to tell the story. Now his mom, May Axton, actually wrote Heartbreak Hotel for Elvis Presley. We do that song on here too as well. dog night song there thank you so much for that request hey you know it is of course it's friday and you know what that means right shall we go do it one two three four come on i thought love was only true in fairy tale meant someone else but not for me oh love was out to get me that's the way it seems Disappointment haunting all my dreams Then I saw her face Now I'm a believer Not a trace But down in my mind I'm in love I'm a believer I couldn't leave her if I tried Thing. Seems the more I gave, the less I got Oh, what's the use of trying? All you get is pain When I needed sunshine, I got rain Then I saw her face Now I'm a believer Not a trace Up down in my mind Get me. That's the way it seemed. Disappointment haunted all my dreams. And then I saw her face. Now I'm a believer, not a trace. Of There you go. Love that song from the, oh, from the one and only. Oh, my goodness. Let's go back, shall we? Being that long at night makes me sad. Well, it brings me down no right. Tossing and turning. And freezing and burning and crying all through the night. Whoa, Julie, 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 do you love me? Julie, 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 do you care? Julie, Julie, are you thinking of me? Julie, Julie, will you still? Much fun together. I was sure that you were mine, but leaving you, baby, is driving me crazy. It's got me.
cry the day I left him Even though you knew I couldn't stay But baby, remember I'll be back September But till then I'll write you every day Oh, truly, truly, truly do you love me We love Bobby Sherman on the show today. Thank you for that request, too. Let's find out right now what happened today in history. This Day in History. March 10th, 1876. In Boston, Alexander Graham Bell successfully tests his invention, the telephone. Bell's assistant hears him say through the device, Mr. Watson, come here. I want to see you. 1969, in Memphis, Tennessee, James Earl Ray pleads guilty to assassinating civil rights leader Martin Luther King Jr. Ray later recants his plea, insisting he's innocent and alleging a conspiracy until he dies behind bars decades later. Put me on the witness stand and find out really what, really what took place. 1985, Konstantin Chernyenko, leader of the Soviet Union for just 13 months, dies in Moscow at age 73. Mikhail Gorbachev succeeds Chernyenko in the Kremlin. 1980, Dr. Herman Tarnauer, author of The Scarsdale Diet, is shot to death at his home in Purchase, New York. Tarnauer's former lover, Jean Harris, is convicted of murder. She serves nearly a dozen years behind bars. And 1965. <laughs> couple opens on Broadway. Neil Simon's play about two mismatched roommates is later a hit on TV and the silver screen. Today in History, March 10th, Sandy Cosell, The Associated Press. This Day in History. Ah, This Day in History. We always enjoy the history of each and every show. Always have something special going on for sure. You know what? We cannot forget about our past. Always remember your past, including music from the past, of course. All right. If you believe in forever, then life is just a one-night stand. If there's a rock and roll heaven, well, you know you took a piece of our hearts Otis brought a song to the dark of the bay Sing a song to light my fire Remember Jim that way They all found another Jimmy touched us with that song Time won't change A friend we come to know Bobby gave us smack the knife Look out, he's back in town They'll all be together When they meet one big show Stay. 
Righteous Brothers. Love the Righteous Brothers. Always enjoy that song. What a great way to kind of wrap up our Friday show. I can't believe <clears throat> how fast today's show went by. It has been absolutely crazy. It seems like we just got started, right? <laughs> anyway, I want to thank the wonderful folks over at Link Senior for making it happen. Go to linkedsenior.com. Find out how your community can get hooked up to an incredible distribution system of news, information, entertainment like this show and the many, many great communities. Join them, linksenior.com. Go there now, find out if your community is looking for a great distribution channel just for you guys. All right, my goodness, as we wrap things down here, I'm like looking through all these great songs. And there was one song I'm gonna end with. Uh, this song right here was a, a number that actually came out years and years ago. And uh, the year 1957 has a lot of significance. Uh, number one, it was the year that my wife Kim was born and number two it was the year that my mom graduated high school the class of 57 and so I thought you know what It'd be a good time today to kind of remember those in the class of 1957 you know we live in such a, a fast-paced uh, world now everything's kind of sped up and truly when you look back those times were quite simple back then we didn't have the computers we didn't have a do it now kind of thing you know, sure, we got a lot of great conveniences, but you know what? It all started somewhere. The class of 57 had different ideas back then and different careers and, and ways to go, and I thought today might be fitting as we kind of wrap up today's show with a little tribute to the wonderful folks that graduated in the 50s, uh, not just 57, but those. Go back. A little story on these. Tommy's selling used cars. Nancy's fixing hand Harvey runs a grocery store Margaret doesn't care Jerry drives a truck for Sears Charlotte's on the make Paul sells life insurance And part-time real estate Helen is a hostess Frank works at the mill Janet teaches grade school Probably always will. Bob works for the city. Jack sells lab research. Peggy plays the organ at the Presbyterian Church. And the class of 57 had his dream. We all thought we'd change the world with our great works and deeds. Or maybe we just thought the world would Change to fit our needs Well, the class of 57 had its dreams Betty runs a trailer park Jan sells Tupperware Randy's on the insane ward Mary's on welfare Charlie took a job with Ford Joe took Freddie's wife Charlotte took a millionaire And Freddie took his wife Johnny's big in cattle, Ray is deep in debt. Where Mavis finally wound up is anybody's bet. Linda married Sonny, Brenda married me. 
And the class of all of us is just a part of history And the class of 57 had its dreams But living life day to day never like it seems Things get complicated when you get past 18 But the class of 57 had its dreams Oh, the class of 57 had its dreams. Y'all, thank you so much for watching the show today. We sure appreciate it. Always is wonderful joy to have you here. We look forward to seeing you on Monday. Our show is every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday right here. I hope you have a great weekend. God bless you. I will see you soon. Take care.